Netcasts you love from people you trust. This is Twit. Now that you have a bucket server all up and running, it is time to choose some mods that will help add features for your server, make sure that you can run the server better or more efficiently, or have more tools at your disposal whenever you're on your server. I have picked out a few mods to help suit your needs. When running your server, you want to protect yourself from cheaters <laughs> or griefers. There's no better way to do that than without this bucket plugin called No Cheat Plus. No Cheat Plus can do things like prevent players from using hacked clients to fly in survival mode and prevent them from abusing enderpearls to get through walls. Players will only be able to interact with blocks within their reach, so no hacked clients like Notice will be able to destroy blocks for them. The plugin also has some handy features to help you manage the chat, like spam protection. It can also do a whole lot more. I suggest reading the full feature list on the plugin page. Next, one of the most popular plugins for general command-like features is Essentials. Some of the general commands that you have are sending and receiving mail, setting a nickname with slash nick. You also have moderator tools like broadcasting a whole server message in chat. You can also look into players' inventories, view private messages that are going on between players, or vanish your character so nobody can see you and spy to make sure nobody's cheating. Next off is Spigot. Spigot is a little bit different because it's not really a mod. It's really a hacked together bucket server jar. Spigot is used on many of the top Minecraft servers to ensure stability. For small servers, it will idle the CPU usage so that you will save power and resources when no players are online. Some other features that it adds is better TPS, ticks per second. You uh, prevent chunk leaks and it automatically stays up to date with the latest bucket changes. And man, after Spigot, there are tons and tons of other mods that you should check out. Iconomy allows you to add in-game currency. There are shops like Sign Shop, which allow players to sell things between each other. There's a mod called Multiverse, which allows you to have tons and tons of world, not just a normal survival world and end another, but multiple flatlands and anything that they possibly want to do. Towny is a, as a mod that allows you to create small towns and manage them. You also have very powerful tools like World Edit, which allows you to edit multiple blocks around a huge range of parameters. There's even chat upgrades like Hero Chat, which allows cool colored text and things like that. In the next video, let me show you how to make your server public so that all of your friends can join from all over the internet, no matter where they are. Are.